In this video, we will demonstrate how to create a staff level user account, how to change a user's password, and reset two factor authentication. Before you begin, you will need to know how you want to group clients and to which staff you want to assign them. If you do not create client groups, your staff users will have access to all clients. If you need to assign staff to specific clients, the first step is to create a client group. Start on the main dashboard. Click on Settings, Users, and then Client Groups. A new window will appear. Click the blue Add Client Group button. In the text box, type the name of your new group. It helps to make this a descriptive name. From the list below, check the boxes of the clients you want to assign to this staff member. Click Save. You will see your new group on the list. In the same row, the number of clients in the group is shown. Now, click the back arrow next to the words Client Groups to return to the main dashboard. Step two is to create a new staff user account. Go back to Settings on the toolbar, then Users, and now select User Accounts. In the window that appears, click the Add User button. Type the staff user's email address in the text box. Select the role for this user. Click next to the word Administrator for the drop-down menu to appear. In this example, we selected the standard role. In the User Group column, click next to the words All Clients. On the drop-down menu, select the group you want to connect with the user. In this example, we are using the group we made earlier. Click Save and then enter your password. The new user will get an email through which they activate their account. Both a super user and agent key user can reset a user's password and 2FA. Go to Settings, select Users, then User Accounts. Right click beside the username. To reset a password, select Password Reset and select the type of reset. To reset 2FA, select two-factor authentication and click Reset 2FA.